In this video, we're going to show you the procedure for wiring the Electra Gear stainless C-Face motor for 220 volts to the Bremis brand drum switch. Bremis brand switches with red handles are supplied by BHUSA. They are NEMA rated up to 20 amps and can be used on any BHUSA supplied single phase reversible AC boat lift motor from 3 quarter horsepower through 1 and a half horsepower, both 110 volts and 220 volts. Here are the kinds of tools you will need for the wiring job. The first thing you always do before attempting any wiring is make sure the power is disconnected. Begin by removing the cover over the wire housing electrical area on the motor. Open the cover. Loosen the ground screw and remove the wire bundle from inside the motor. On new motors, the wires are extra long. You will need to cut off approximately 2 inches from all wires. All wires will eventually be connected with wire nuts, so strip one half inch off the ends of each motor wire. It is recommended to twist the wires together on the Bremis switch harness and put a slight bend in them so they will easily fit through the cable gland. Strip the green ground from the switch wires about a quarter of an inch. Strip all other switch wires one half inch. Put a male spade on the ground wire and crimp it tightly. Do not leave any bare wire showing above or below the spade. Connect the white switch wire with the motor wire number 4 and secure with a wire nut. Connect motor wires 2, 3 and 5 together and secure with a wire nut. Connect the orange switch wire to motor wire number 1 and secure with a wire nut. The black motor wire in a 220 volt application is not used, so simply secure it with a wire nut. Now connect the number 8 motor wire with the red switch wire and secure with a wire nut. Connect the green ground wire to the ground screw and tighten the screw securely. Carefully place all wires back into the motor and put the wire housing cover back in place. Tighten all screws securely. The last step is to tighten the gland nut to ensure the motor remains waterproof. Plug the motor in and remember to test it you must reset the GFCI switch for a 220 volt motor or it will not operate. 
Set the switch to up and the motor should go clockwise. Let the motor come to a full stop. Then set the switch to down and the motor should go counterclockwise. For demonstrations on wiring other motors with the Burmis brand drum switch, take a look at the other videos in this series available on our website bh-usa.com.